and because I have big fingers and don't know what I'm doing, I just shut that video off, but I've already conversated on it, so this will be a short -er -er version of that video. So, Prince on a Raft, you're going to find this incredibly satisfying, the pull-off of the raft, which you just throw away. Then we will glue little uh, printed letters on it. The spool's pretty light. So I guess I could show you how to home it, and then we could check the clearances, which might again might be useful for rigs. So you go in, you select your printer. Every printer will have something like this. Control. Not that button. Not that button either. This button, Lily's barking at something. So we'll tell it to auto home. The printer's gonna go and do its deal. These are not as exciting. I'm less likely to get hurt doing these, I suppose. If I had a GoPro yesterday when I cooked dinner, that might have been entertaining because I did manage to remove a portion of my thumb. Not focusing very well. It's super glued, so I'm fine. Okay, so there, it's auto homed. And you go back in. You tell it to disable the steppers, which then frees up the whole printer bed, right? Because now you can move it all by hand. So what you're looking for is your clearance, which may or may not be something you see. Your clearance between that head there and the bed. And you want it consistent all the way around, right? So I've got this very expensive, actually, Caterpillar tool that I use as a feeler gauge. Then you slide into all four corners, make sure it's consistent, pull your bed forward, consistent, go down here. Because what happens over time is your rollers can get a little out of alignment or these adjuster screws can back off. And then that will cause some weird, some weird prints. So there you go. We're pretty consistent all the way around. And like I said, those two prints it burned out this little guy's spool, so we're going to tell it to print some more of those SD uh, logos. Well, look who it is. Come here, Dren. Because you're in the house, you're not supposed to be. Why are you like this? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Pwn them. And there you go. Now it's going to print. This print will only take about four hours. And then I have to figure out something for dinner. So we'll figure out that. Then maybe start a different print tomorrow or mess with the resin printer. Anyway, like, leave a comment.